Back to baseball, and on Saturday, the Mets Academy in the Dominican Republic held a graduation for more than 100 players and staff. There were some special guests on hand to help congratulate the graduates, and our Andy Martino has the story. The Mets over the weekend held their annual graduation ceremony at their Dominican Academy. 164 players and staff members received either a college degree, a high school diploma, or a certificate to continue their education. This has always been a big deal for a Mets organization that's prioritized education in the Dominican Republic. To show it was a big deal, Carlos Mendoza, the manager, gave a speech, and David Stearns, the president of baseball operations, also attended. You know, this is something that the Mets have done for a long time. The Mets, way back in 2006, were one of the first organizations to really take responsibility for continuing education um, at high school level education for their players here. And it's become a really important part of our organization's identity. Um, it means a lot to us as an organization, and it's become the example for the rest of the industry. Since 2006, the Mets have graduated more than 500 players from this program, including current catcher Francisco Alvarez, who earned his high school diploma here two years ago. At one point, Francisco was one of them, you know, and uh, for him to be here in such a special day, for a lot of them and for all of us as an organization was, was pretty neat. They all got the same goals, the same dream, is to play in the big leagues. As an organization, we're not only trying to develop a championship caliber player, the championship caliber people. Ever since Omar Minaya was general manager from 2005 to 2010, continuing education in addition to baseball here in the Dominican Republic have been high priorities for the Mets organization, a fact underscored by the released players over the years who have gone on to earn degrees and certificates that have helped them begin careers outside of baseball and continue for the rest of their lives. This is part of Omar's legacy with the Mets. Uh, this was very important to him. Um, he was a big force behind the push, not only for the Mets, but for Major League Baseball as a whole to provide growth opportunities for our players, regardless of whether they stay in pro ball or not. And that's a big part of this here today. Um, it's preparing our players in the event that they don't stay in pro ball, uh, which many players don't reach the major leagues. And this is a big part of them finding success after their baseball careers are over.